Warning, this video is not targeted to kids and may be inappropriate to younger audiences. Your discretion is advised. Hey then, hello! Dudes and dudettes, it's your favorite Reject Gamer Mix 17 here, and I am back once again with another Subnautica episode. Now, uh, I did some things, um, not a whole lot, just, just, uh, got this base a little bit more up and running. I used the scanner quite a bit, and, uh, well, I guess you can say I did a few things. Wow, oh, oops, I'm on the wrong side, and I just fell. Ooh. Oh wait, is this thing loaded? Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah, this thing's loaded. Good. Alright, like as I was saying, I did a few things off camera. Uh <clears throat> and a lot of farming. And as you can see from my prawn suit uh upgrade module. I should probably put this in here just in case. Might come in handy. I ended up getting hold of a few things, such as a thermal reactor which recharges power cells in hot areas, which I think is going to come very handy in the very near future. In fact, maybe even this episode. Uh, the prawn suit depth module, of course, because I'm going to need that to get deeper. Ugh, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> going deeper into the ocean. Ugh. I already know it's going to probably kill me. Anywho, uh, hull reinforcement, which is... I did this just as a precaution. It might come in handy, just the fact of where I know where I'm going. And, oh god, I already know it's going to be a nightmare. And, of course, the prawn suit jet upgrade. Because I was struggling with my jets uh, system. Anywho, before I actually do go out there, uh, for like a brief moment, uh, I mean, like a few seconds to be honest, I don't know why I just didn't jump out. On the my, on my screen, I ended up having this uh, what's it called radio thing, and I want to build it. So I yes, thank you, thank you, bigger boat, and it's titanium and copper. All right, I wanted to build the radio down here. That way, I can finally get this thing, whatever it is. Because personally, I am curious. I don't know what it is, so. Yeah, I honestly can't think of any other radio frequency. Radio frequency, radio broadcast, whatever it's called. I can't think of anything else, so I want. I'm very curious. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Yep. Uh, I, I I know the exact translation is that uh, <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> but just on repeat, over and over and over again. Heck, the radio had to say, "You want know nah, I gotta cut it for this poor dude." So it just put dot dot dot. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, no, I don't know how that's translated. I'm pretty sure there is a translation, but I'm not 100 sure. Ooh, what was that sound? Anywho. Uh, but yeah, it is time for me to go deeper into the dark abyss and probably crying out my eyes. No, I'm kidding. Because, yeah, where we are going, we are going deep into dangerous waters. So that's fun. Apparently, I did not make dime. I didn't bring diamonds with me, so I kind of screwed myself over with that. Anywho, um... I'm going to bring a, f a bit of equipment. I don't know how much I can carry, so I'm going to bring four. Probably not regret that. I'm more than likely to regret that. And I'm going to grab... I want a good amount of inventory space. So I'm going to be most likely in the prawn suit. I don't think I'm going to need my stasis rifle. Ooh. Um... Uh, let's see, what else, what else? What I might need, though, for a definite fact, is I'm going to have to carry some food with me before I die of hunger and stuff. Bring the tablets, bring, I don't know, three medkits might do. Uh, I'll bring uh, two of these, just for 
safety. And I'm gonna bring like, I don't know, five, because I was not drink one of them right now. Boom. Oh, am I ready for this? No, we're close. I'm gonna die. Yep, yep, you tell me that. And apparently I've been here for 121 days. Woohoo! I think that's what, like a quarter of a year if I'm memorizing this? Yeah, roughly. Pretty close, yeah. A quarter of a year, depending on if it's a leap year. Uh, for which this year uh, of 2020, it is a leap year, so we'll consider it a leap year. So I am close to a third throughout the year. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Uh, probably not a good idea to use 2020. Uh, let's wish for everything. Anywho, um, yeah. I'm gonna die. Hard and time. Oh, hold on. Let me double check my side. My bigger boat. The bigger boat. Alright, how's my power doing? Alright, it's doing pretty good. And it could go up to 113. 113? Um,. 1,300 meters, which is good, because I'm going to need it to go that deep. Oh boy. Am I ready for this? No, I'm not. Do I want to do this? It's kind of half and half. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to go as deep as I possibly can with the Cyclops, and then afterwards, now I'm going to go as far as I'm comfortable with my Cyclops, and then afterwards, I bail w uh, into the prawn suit. That's it. Ooh. All right. You know what? Hold on. I just realized something. I need to go back up here real quick again. I forgot to do something. I have a torpedo thing for a reason. Oh shoot, you know what, whatever. I'm just gonna drop. Oh shoot. Was not trying to do that, but that worked. Oh shoot, nope. Don't wanna do that. There we go. That worked. But I kind of did not want to be in here. Alright, but yeah. Since I'm going down there just for the sole... <sighs> ...thing to explore... I'm not looking forward to this, to be honest. I am terrified. Out of my mind. I'm going to go ahead and install... ...this sucker. Because I had this just in case I ever ran into an issue. It's been in there for a while. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it. And yeah, it is time for me to install the torpedo uh, using a quite a weak torpedo, sadly. But, oh hey look. Alright, I used the powerful ones and if I run into any trouble, any other trouble, I'll use the other ones. Alright, I'm not looking forward to this. Alright, uh, one big reason why I'm gonna bring the Cyclops with me part way is also just for, uh, what's it called? Just for the sole purpose of traveling a little bit easier than having to use the prawn suit and draining out its battery because of it. Oh, by the way, I also got a fire suppression uh, system on on the bigger boat, so I shouldn't have to worry too much about fire. I'll just have to worry about damage. Alright, let's back this up. Because I know I got plenty of space. Alright. Let's turn... I'm going to turn this ship around. Oh boy, I'm not looking forward to this. Alright, so I did some exploration and I found out where I have to go. At least the general area I have to go to. I actually have to go through this area, 
which by the way, uh, check out the ghost stream, that's pretty cool. Uh, one day I, I'm not, when I'm done with this game, I'm not gonna be fully done. I'm actually gonna do a small mini-series, I, I guess you can say. And I just read all the, not all of them, but I just read as much as I can for whatever it is I have. I'm gonna try to obtain all the knowledge I can, but no promises there. I'm gonna try to read all the things. The, what's it called? Ah, the, the data, data things. I'm not clicking right now, am I? <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm going through the wrong area? Please tell me that's not the case. Oh good, I'm not. I know exactly where I'm at. I almost fell through the map from here. Yeah, um... <laughs> for some reason, I had like a lot of issues with the world not loading properly. And I fell a few times. But yeah, check out this place. Even though it looks terrifying, even though it should be terrifying, it's actually pretty peaceful here. With all these rays, it's peaceful. It's actually pretty nice too. Anywho, I'm gonna switch to camera mode. Now I know. Oh shoot! I'm going up, not down. All right, all right. Cool, cool, cool. I've also started uh, slowly getting better with my. Uh, driving skills here. Alright, so I gotta be careful. Because here's where it gets a bit tricky. And a lot more hot. Alright, so I think this is where I can finally do the proper introduction. I heard something weird. Alright. Ooh, that doesn't even help. Alright, well, uh, yeah. Welcome to, while well, we slowly approach our destination, I have to say welcome to the inactive lava zone. The place of many horrors. Little shop of horrors. <laughs> All right, I think this is as far as I'm getting with the Cyclops. I don't want to get too crowded. Unless I think so. Hold on. Maybe I could fit. Maybe I could fit. Maybe I could fit. Maybe I could fit. And I fit. Not bad. Check out the depth. I'm doing good. But yeah. Oh boy, we're gonna be missing. We're gonna be meeting someone special. Someone special and someone who has a lot of fan art. <laughs> Trust me, I've seen them. All right. Oh, I, I'm, ho I'm hoping I'll go to the right direction. I hope I'm going in the. I know where I'm going. Um. Everything's not loading, I don't think. Is, are, is it? Or is it just like super dark? Ugh. Yep, there's a... Uh... Yep, I know where I'm at. I think this is as far as I go. Oh, whoops, hold on. Before I actually do go and turn you off. Alright. Let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. I'm not ready. Why do that? Oh, you don't know, that was a good thing. Alright, alright, alright. Shake off the nerves, shake off the nerves. Alright. Let's do this! I'm gonna die! Did I just fire? I did, by accident. I just wasted a vortex. Of all things I could have wasted, I waste the vortex. Alright. 
whatever. What's done is done. Let's move on. Alright, so if... Oh, shoot. Alright. All I have to do is just go straight. I hope. Nope, 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 no, dear God, get me out of here. No, no, no. All right. Oh, dear God, he sees me, or she sees me. I forgot they're all female. Yep, one day I'm going to come back and I'm going to scan you all, but today's not that day. Going through here? Nope. Oh dear God. What the hell? Uh. <gasps> I don't like it. Nope. Nope. Hug the wall. Hug the wall. Hug the wall. Hug the wall. <gasps> no. Bad idea. 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 No, 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 no. This looks like a walking area. If that's the case, I'm walking. I'm walking and squawking. I swear to God, if I get one of those dang stupid battery draining bugs on me. I'm going to be mad. Ooh. Hey, I think I found the entrance. Please tell me that's the entrance. No, but that should be a good sign. Oh, mother of God. Some of the texture's not even loading. Where do I go inside this thing? Bigger boat. Oh, dear God. God, no. You, 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 you. Stay there. I do not want to go out. 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 I never want to go out. Wait, is this the entrance? Nope. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> I can't even come out of my prawn suit without dying. From the absolute enormous amount of heat. Oh, that's right. My no wonder my uh, my super suit is not draining of power. I got the thermal reactor on this thing. Ooh, I don't like that sound. Kyrite crystal. Where were you when I needed you? Ooh, ooh. How do I get in this thing? Oh, did I find it? I found it. I found it. Get me in there. Get me in there. Get me in there. Get me in here. Get me in here. Oh, there's some things in here. Oh, I want to get out. I want to get out and pick up some of the stuff. It's gonna be hot, it's gonna be hot. Wait, what? The volcanic rock, which has formed in this area, can be carbon dated to between 800 and 3000 Earth years ago. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you for the information. I bet it's hot right here. Ooh. Huh. How, how is it not burning me alive? I should be burning alive right now. Alright. Ooh. Alright. Well, I don't care. All I know is that I got in here somehow, and I'm a little bit lagging. But that's kind of to be expected, considering the fact that I'm in a very, very area that should, in fact, be... Oh, shoot. 
here we are. Here we. Oh dear God. Uh, welcome everyone to the active lava zone. But first, before we do that, oh shoot, lag, 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 land. Okay. But first, before we do that, we got ourselves another. I think this is an, the other quarantine. In uh, oh shoot, quarantine precursor lab. If I remember correctly, I'm not 100 percent sure. Uh, ah, there's the entrance. Can I reach? Yes. Whew. Thank you. And I'm safe in here, luckily. Alright, I remember at one point, those, those crawlers used to do damage. I can't remember 100% if they still do. Oh, I think they do. Yep, they do. They do. They do, alright. No. And they're invincible. That's what's scary. Should've stuck with my prawn suit. Should've stuck with the ion cubes, too. Alright, let me run back and pick up my prawn suit. Along the way, switch out one of the arms. Oh yeah, I don't have any maggots on me, right? Nah, I'm good. Cool. Alright. Oh, yeah, I should probably remove the uh, things in here, huh? Just in case. I don't know how the system works, and I don't want to try it out right now. <laughs> I only got one more <laughs> torpedo, and I don't want to risk it all. Not yet. Anywho. Boop. Boop. And enter. Let's bring the almighty bronze suit. Yeah, how do you, what do you think of me now, huh? How do you like me now? I hear this weird sound in the background. Does anyone else hear that? Boom. Boom. The way that those things just fall so slowly, uh, I don't think that's a good thing. I don't think gravity works in here that way that way, because I sure as heck don't fall that way. Hey, not bad. I got multiple there. Now give me more. Because these lion cubes are like... <laughs> these things are like better than gold. When it comes to power. Alright, cool. Now give me a few of these, because... Actually, I think I only need maybe two. Just for the safe side. Alright, put this in here, boop, and open up. Alright, let, do I want to? Do I really want to risk it? Let's risk it. Let's risk it, let's risk it, let's risk it all, why not? If I die, I'm going to die with knowledge <laughs> and fear I swear to god if it dares I, I can't remember if they moved there or not but there used to be once a precursor in the side of a crater uh, like an actual crater look like thing I think it was an actual crater I can't remember and uh, there used to be a reaper leviathan that used to roam that area I can't remember if they removed it or not I'm pretty sure they didn't I just can't find it it's terrifying, though. <laughs> I remember seeing it once, and I'm like, oh, dear God. Not in-game. Not in-game. I saw it, like, once in the, uh... In one of the, the developers shows things. Whatever you want to call it. This thing's taking a while. Oh. Hey, where did I spawn? Where did I spawn? Wait a minute, am I the, the GU? No. Am I? It looks like it. I don't remember seeing. Oh, wait. No, I think this is the GUE, isn't it? GUE, G U N. I'm 
pretty sure it is. Huh. Well, that that explains a lot. Oh yeah, I remember this now. I remember. Yep, this is this is the teleporter for. Okay. Now I know where I'm at. Now then, let's go back and hopefully the game doesn't glitch me through the thing again, or else this is gonna be a very, very, very short life. <laughs> I don't know. That's always been one of my like nerves whenever I play video games. The fact that the world just glitches so badly, you fall through the map. Because in some games it's not that bad, but in this game, ugh, it's terrifying. Because once you just reach a specific drop, ugh, it's like freaky, super freaky. But luckily, eventually, you'll uh, fall right back up. So you'll teleport once you hit to a specific drop. I think it's... They, I know they changed it several times. Because at one point, you could swim on and on forever. And there was no limits. And there used to be like weird soundtracks once you reached the, uh, out of these, the playable area. And it was like a really weird uh, thing. And then eventually, they put up uh, like an actual lore behind the whole thing. Oh, don't glitch on me. Alright. Well, yeah, that was a very, very interesting time. Oh, hey, perfect. Purple. I don't know how many purple tablets I got, but I'll t take them in there. Hey, there's a blue one. And I can scan it. Let me scan this puppy. I'm going on foot a little bit. Never mind, I don't want to go on foot. I want to hop back in here. Come oh. Here to me. You betcha. But first I want to do some exploration. Eh, hey, you little punk. <laughs> Hurting me and everything. Alright, and here it is. Ah, oh, this place. Whew, different story with so many things. Now then. Ooh, give me this data entry. I'm gonna run out of tablets. I'm gonna run out of purple tablets specifically. And then I'm screwed. Yeah, because how many purple tablets do I got? I got none. I'm doomed. Oh yeah, that's right. I could scan this, can't I? Alien Thermal Plant. Alright, I'll listen. Alien facility location updated. Volcanic huh. area connected to this cave system. Huh. At depth, 1.4 kilometers. Alright. Integrating yes! EDA data. I got it. Ion. Power blueprints from alien data. Blueprints stored to data bank. Alright, let's play this. Why not? Hey? Oh, wait, hold on. I can't play it. I gotta read it. <laughs> you know what? We've reached this far. Let's read it. Alright, so let's see. Uh, da -da -da -da. It should be under. Yeah, here we go. Alien data and I got a few things I got artifacts which I'm gonna wait for another time here we are so alien arch uh, oh yes this was the teleportation device that I scanned all right alien robot <clears throat> alien ro robot uh, this device is an of alien origin although its design is relatively simple one purpose its low threat level is at odds with the advanced technology apparently available to its designers, suggesting it was intended more to patrol alien facilities and repair damaged infrastructure than to deter invaders? I'm assuming that's how you pronounce it. Um, design. Despite its simple design, this construction is quite elegant 
in its minimalism uh, four X electromagnetic legs allow it to transversal floors, walls, and ceilings with reasonable speed and, a, and appear to be replaceable internally with a few moving parts, rendering its construction energy efficient and resistant to wear over time. A rechargeable ion power reserve ensures it continues to operate. Uh, assessments immobilize and return to Altera for manual profit. Mutual profit. What? I could wait. I could destroy these things. I don't know that. Alien thermal plant. Uh, this system directly converting local thermal energy into electric current at 90% efficiency. God dang, where's the 10% then? Uh, most of its energy is being stored in the battery-like devices within the plant itself, which it wait each of which holds enough of a small enough to power a small city for a year. Uh, some of it, however, is being drained off, presumably, as it is distributed to other facilities on the planet. The power plant appears to be fully automatic and given the current understanding of the mechanism involved, uninterrupted. Alien vent. Oh, I remember this. Uh, it's one of those weird fish vents that I'll show you on that sometime. Uh, these vents connected to an ancient piping network that extends beyond maximum scannable depth. The pumping system is still functional. The inflow vent is drawing water from the surrounding area and pumping an unknown to an unknown location below the surface. Warm, deoxygenated water is being expelled into the atmosphere. Most creatures are avoiding the vents. Peepers can obviously enter and exiting entering and exiting the pipe network without signs of distress. Assessment further research acquired. I'm gonna get that soon. Of course, this one smooth, cold, and light blue, which illuminates an alien symbol resembling the uppercase H. While it is unlikely these devices serve in part as security clearance for whoever constructed them, their size suggests some additional purpose such as personal computers which in the case the technology is far beyond humans humanity's own uh, energy core I showed this force field I showed this ion cube I showed this the orange tablet this device humps slightly and displays an orange lit symbol resembling an N uh, it may offer a way to interact with a comp with compatible technologies, purple tablet research probes. The pro minutes, minutes, pro min ends, and facing of these alien devices suggest there are some kind of probe or sensor. Uh, these s their subject would seem to be the vast skeleton in the center, oh right, of the cavern and attached cable network that lead to the remote power station or hub. Assessment, investigate. Yeah, that was when I uh, checked that out. Oh yeah, I'm gonna check this out. Warpers. Alright, third terminal. There we go. Uh, I also got some of these here. I uh, checked this one out. Uh, damage reports. Oh, this was for the uh, containment facility. Uh, secondary containment facility, if I remember correctly. A Leviathan detected at facility perimeter, closing at high speed. Exterior anchor cable uh, impact with massive force. Exterior anchor system buckling. Facility sinking. Collision at sea floor. Breaches detected with. Uh, in containment unit 7, Leviathan eggs. Uh, immediate specimen deconstruction protocol in t in it. Uh, 314 species destroyed, one spe specimen unaccounted for. Evacuating staff to off-site sanctuaries. 
planetary quarantine protocol initiated. Warning, infected individuals may not leave the planet. Yep, there it is. And then I think I checked this one out at some point. I don't know. Fossil, uh, fossil data recorded with the, uh, from the volcanic rock of the evacu- wait, was if excavated at, to construct the alien power facility. It is pos- it's been possible to extra- extrapolate it by a number of key trends. Trends, yeah. Uh, genetic dry. Hold on, I need to like turn this guy a bit. Uh, divergence. The alien record recorded. The aliens recorded data on indigenous organic remains, originating between 10,000 to 1,000 years ago. The life forms on record feature an unusual low overlap with those encountered so far on 4546B. Extinction event. Uh, soil samples from 1,000 years ago contain 30% higher concentrations of organic remains in than the soil average. Data supports the mass extinction of killing off a majority of specimens and forcing rapid adaptation amongst many survivors. Yeah, that sadly didn't work. Ion power data. I swear, I'm going to destroy my voice. It has been possible to extract useful information regarding the alien ion power. Uh, ion cubes are grown artificially with a material substance and are treated to remain a state stable state despite a huge ionic energy contained within. I knew it. This would be technically unstable because of the fact that it's made of ionic energy. I figured as much. Uh, it's like weird chemistry stuff. No, chemistry. Yeah, chemistry. Yeah, yeah, it's, I'm taking it correctly. Uh, by installing an ion cube to the appropriate device, this energy can be released as electrical power. Using this knowledge, it is possible to synthesize new battery and power cell blueprints, which leverage advanced advanced ionic energy to last considerably longer. And then the Karar Contagion Profile which is a lot. This is going to destroy my voice. <clears throat> this terminal contains extensive data regarding to no regarding the bacterial contagion identified as Cara or the Carar. Uh yeah, the Carar. There you go. Uh, discovery first encountered during routine network expansions to on other outwards. I mean, a uh, pandemic development. Network errors resulted in routine quarantine procedure fail failure. Contagion what? Contagion? Contagion? Something like that? Uh, was uploaded to and spread quickly through the core worlds. Confirmed deaths 143 billion individuals. God dang. Bacteria me bacterial mechanisms attaches to healthy living cells and mutates the basic genetic structure. Symptoms stage 1. Gradual immune system failure. Stage 2. Green skin lesions and flu like systems. Stage 3. Unpredictable alterations to biological structure. Stage 4. Complete shutdown of executive function. That's terrifying. Uh, emergency steps taken. Core worlds quarantined. Bacterial samples distributed to isolated disease research facilities for vaccine development. Treatment procedure unknown. Basically, I'm going to die. <laughs> Whew, that was a good amount of reading. That just destroyed my voice. And, uh, yeah. And now I got some power cells. Actually, these things are not that bad. Oh, and then I say that. <laughs> Alright. Let's get out of here and let's continue on into the deep dark. Not the deep dark, but into the fiery pits of hell. And let's go see the Satan of uh, Subnautica. I'm kidding, that's not the Satan of Subnautica. 
Again, I'm going to come back for one of you fools. I want to see if I can actually kill you. All right. Huzzah! Oh, shoot. All right, so where do I have to go? That's what I want to know. Did I have to go here? Or did I come from there? I think I came from there, didn't I? Because I now have to go deeper from obvious indications, but... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I came from there. So where do I... Are you kidding me? We got warpers here, of all places. I don't want warpers. Oh, shoot. All right, hold on. I think there's an entrance right there. Oh, now you want to tell me about seek fluid intake. Nonsense. Oh, shoot. I'm stuck. Oh, shoot. I'm lagging. Uh, I, th I think I found the right place. All right, let's go through here. And try not to die. Oh, dear God, I'm going to die. Hold on, am I going the right place? Yeah, be gone. Away with you. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not going the right place. Let me... Wait, I got something else here, too? What could I possibly have gotten? Uh... Nothing? I'm missing something, apparently. I'll check it out later. More. Vital signs stabilizing. Hmm. I'm obviously missing something. I just don't know what I'm missing. Uh, I'm thinking about just cutting from here, and then I will continue when I actually find my way out. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll be right back. Alright, well. <clears throat> I don't think it's in here. If it is, I'm not finding it. I think it's somewhere out here instead. I'm gonna drop, 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 drop. Oh. Oh, that's... That's nice to see. That's exactly what I want to see. Get down, get down, get down. It's time. I don't know the actual words. I wish I did. This would make the karaoke night very easy, interesting. Get me out of here now. Hmm? Oh, I thought this was the entrance I was going to say. Hooray! But no. Of course not. Why would it? be the entrance. That's an oddly shaped deposit. What is that anyway? I almost want to go over there and check it out. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna die. Oh, shoot, of course I can't reach. Why would I... wait. No, that doesn't look like it. Ooh. I don't know the way, 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 I don't know the way. If that da if that stupid meme about Knuckles saying, do you know the way? I'm not going to say no, I don't. I'm going to take that as a no. I'm not going there. No. <laughs> Oh god, is this it? Stop. Risk it. Risk it. Risk it! Mm, I swear to god, if something dare claws at me, I'm gonna be mad. Claws at me or anything, I'm gonna be mad. Okay. Now, I think I'm in the active level zone. Oh, yeah. 
I made it. Welcome everyone to Jurassic Park. Now I'm kidding. Oh dear God! Welcome to the active lava zone, where I'm gonna die. Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Is that my savior? Where is this thing? Sorry about my dog. Whoa, that actually like screwed up my. Get off my screen, that would help. Where is this guy? I don't see him. I thought there would be another sea dragon. Again? Oh, I actually need to eat too. Wait, what am I talking about? That's exactly what it told me. Nearly crashed into that. Ooh, that's blinding. Ooh. Let me check this out. Do 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 do. Boom. Vital Boom. Stabilizing. All right, where is this thing? I swear to God, if it's a it's a purple. If it's purple. Oh, thank God. Good, because I actually ran out. Purple. All right. We. Made it. Oh. Translating local alien broadcast. Warning: Vaccine development program terminated. Emperor egg fetching project terminated. Life specimens terminated. Evacuate immediately. No thanks. You know, no, I'm not gonna do this one yet. I have just enough time to see the queen and are you kidding me right now wait what's over here Enzyme 42 data project. Let's know. If anything, I'm just gonna do something real stupid. That might get me killed. But oh well, what doesn't get me killed? <laughs> What's in here anyway? Uh, there's something else that I'm missing apparently. And it's another blueprint. Oh, here it is. Oh, of course. Alright, let's check out this Enzyme 42. <clears throat> According to translated data logs, an indigenous Leviathan specimen was found to produce a unique substance referred to as Enzyme 42, which inhibited the, per the symptoms of the Karar bacteria. Uh, da -da -da, bacterial infection. Uh, in other indigenous organisms. The specimen was captured and contained in an in a purpose-built habitat for further study. The alien researchers went to great lengths to provide for the life forms environmental needs, including the import of independent flora and uh Fauna, 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 via an on site warp gate. However, its health quickly deteriorated. When quarantine, uh, when quarantine was imposed, all warp gates and force fields were sealed. All attempts to develop enzyme into a vaccine were unsuccessful. Basically, I'm gonna die. <laughs> What's in here anyway? Oh, Warper's right. This is not gonna be. This is not gonna be fun. This is not gonna be fun. All right. This is where I'm gonna end the episode because I gotta get another purple tablet, and that means I'm probably gonna have to travel real far. Oh boy. Thank you everyone for joining me, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.
Thank <laughs> you.